Thank you guys for tuning in again. Today we're going to have a look at how we can import user cabs into the X8 using Fractal Audio Systems Cab Lab Lite. So I'm going to assume here that you know how to connect the X8 to your computer or Mac via USB and that you've gone ahead and downloaded either some free IRs or some of the great aftermarket IRs by people like Ownhammer or uh, ML. You know, there's a lot of great third-party impulse responses on the web at the moment. They're all really affordable and I think they can really, really help you carve out, you know, a unique tone all your own with the X8. So let's get straight into it. I've got some impulses sitting on my computer from Ownhammer that I've downloaded and I've got Cab Lab Lite, which is the free version here. Uh, and what we're going to do is let's first start by connecting our X8. So we're going to click here on the connect button, select X8. And it will tell us right here that we're connected uh, while it communicates and sets everything up. So we just have to sit here and wait while it does that. And we should be good to go. So the next thing we want to do is we want to load up an IR. We'll choose mixer slot number one and hit load. And what this is going to do is bring up uh, the finder on a Mac here, which I'll dry, drag in. And we just want to locate our impulse response file. What I've done here on my computer is I have taken the zip file I got when I downloaded uh, my impulses from the Ownhammer website. And as you can see here in your documents, there should be a folder called Fractal Audio. And we're going to select Workspace. And for here, I've gone Axe Edit cabs and I have stored my impulses as you can see here the Marsh UK multi cab I've stored it in here just so I know where everything is let's go ahead and open that one up as we can see here now this particular pack the Marsh UK multi cab there's a bunch of files I'm just going to go into the quick start file here and let's just pick out the very first impulse which I believe is a 1 by 12 Marshall with fanes you can see the name there it's a wave file at the moment so let's click that and we'll open him up now, of course, we can't bump WAV files into the X8 directly, but we can use Cab Lab to convert them uh, to the correct format. And as you can see here, we've now loaded up our impulse, saying that it's a WAV file, and you can see a really cool printout here of the waveform. You can either select frequency or you can select time there, uh, which if you're a nerd like me and you enjoy looking at graphs is really, really cool. All we have to do from here is we've now got our impulse loaded up. We can see the mix out. If we look down here, it says send mix to user cab number. Well, that's pretty easy. Let's go ahead and do that. If we click on it, it'll communicate with the X8. And if we wait a little bit, it will come up with in the X8. These are all our user cab slots. As you can see, we've got 512 user cab slots, which is pretty awesome. And you can see here that I've already bumped a couple in. A couple of these are from the Exchange, and I've already bumped in some of the Ownhammer cabs. These ones here, the Larry Mitchell ones, are great. Great to start with. I believe they're available as a bundle on the Fractal website. So I'm just going to go to the first empty slot here, which is number 33. I'll click that. I'll click Save and it will send it to the X8. Beautiful. There we go. If we now go into the X8, I'll use X8 Edit and bring it up. We should be able to find that user cab. I'll just drag this in here. So I've got a preset loaded up here. If I go to the cab in my X8 and I click on the cab block, we should just wait a little bit. It should bring up the user cab slots and there we go. There is my new user cab, which we converted from a WAV file using Cab Lab. I can load it up and I can play my guitar, which is what we're all here to do. So there you go. That's how we can bump user cabs into the X8. Uh, I'd really encourage everybody to go and, you know, if you're interested in this, check out some of the impulses from Ownhammer or some of the other companies that are doing impulses. Uh, it's quite a few at the moment. And, you know, for anywhere from 10 bucks to 70 bucks, you can completely 
you know, expand your universe of available tones in the Axe 8. Uh, if you like these videos, please share them and subscribe to my channel and I will hopefully have some more videos for you guys in the near future. Thank you so much.